Gelo Spin Mango Man here. I'm gonna play Fahrenheit 9-11. No, it's not 9-11. I don't know why I said that. But I think there's a movie called that. Well, anyway, we get that bookstore open. Some books on the ground. Okay, so it's a bridge. It's nice and snowy. Oh, icicles. Okay, seems like this traffic light is not working and somebody must have hit it. They should. They should. Someone should really attend to that, there could be an accident here, but, but then again, traffic light going into a bridge with a gate underneath it, which leads nowhere. Hmm. Is this game going to make a lot of sense? Who knows? Yes, it might be a good game, but it might not be. TV screens not showing Jack. New game, new movie. Okay. New movie. No, I don't know about that. Alright, I checked all that. Blah blah blah. Yakety schmack. New movie then. We go. Tutorial? Nah. New game. Yeah, first time playing this game. Proceed. Yeah, I started it a minute ago, but it was just to do voice check. But it's alright now. It's working crisp. It's, it seems to be working crisp. I don't know. Quantic Dream. Quantum Heights. Yeah, that's a deep tune. All right. Things are never quite what they seem. Is it really? We think we understand the world around us, but we really only see the outside. But do you? What it seems to be. Is it? I used to be just like you. No. I believed in humanity, the newspapers, soap commercials, politics, oh, and history like books. But one day, the world kicks you in the teeth. And you don't have any choice but to see things the way they really are. My name is Lucas Kane. My story is the one where an ordinary guy has something extraordinary happen to him. Maybe it was supposed to happen. Maybe it was my destiny or my karma or whatever. I know one thing for sure. Nothing's ever going to be the same again. Citizen Lucas Kane on the case. Let's see what you can get up to probably. Probably gonna murder someone. Yeah, I saw that minute ago, but yeah, bloody hell, that's what happens. It all started right here. Where else could it happen? New York, capital oh, of the city. universe. The chessboard Destiny chose for the last big game. Capital of the universe. I was just another pawn living my pawn's life. Until that night, when my life descended into chaos. Chaos. Okay, Valerie, mocap designer, going well. Animation manager, Jocelyn. Oh. Okay, production. Now it seems like a lot of women making this game. All right, okay. Girls uh, doing it for themselves now it seems. All right. Ah, I do like the soundtrack so far. Sounding very nice. He knows something. Yep. <coughs> Got a little twitch there. Wash your hands, mate. this game for like five minutes just this bit where he kills him and I think it's safe to say that the crow is the leader look at the crow just just on the edge like watching okay still right citizen Kane Again. 
nice. Nice bit of murderation there. There we go. Okay, make sure. Make sure he's dead. Yep, you the man. Seems like the girl from the ring has joined the game. Yeah, now nah, he pretends what? that nothing's happened. What? What have I done? Aha, the crow. I... I didn't want... It was like a dream. He knows. The crow knows everything. The old popo down. Quick. I I've I've gotta get out of here, but before somebody comes in here. When this icon in the upper right corner is on screen, your progress is automatically saved on hard drive. Save. Okay, nice. Yeah, work that you need to drag the mouse in the directions to do things. So yeah, let's hide the body. Alright. Okay, left and right. Tap tap tap. So the toilet there. Nice bit of depression. The knife. I've got to get rid of it. Yeah, it's always handy to keep a knife handy. Lucas, doing well. Plus five. Claiming them points there. Lucas Hearts. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. Try that blood. Make it easier to... Well, don't make it easier to clean, but oh well. Let's clean oh, shit now. Ah, I magically rolled down his sleeves there. Nice. Looking cool. Don't worry, mate. You'll do well. Let's just rub our feet in the blood here. Make sure we. it up. Now we can dry our hands. Alright. We're good to go. Nice. Okay. Hello, buddy. You got a problem, pal? You want to take a picture? Uh, excuse yes, me. Please. Yeah, that's right. Get out of here. He looks like he's getting drunk off coffee, mate. You're in the wrong place. You should go to a bar. Never know. What's this? Let's take a seat. Eat our food. Yes. Drinks. Coffee? I never drink it. I hate it. Was I with someone? I can't remember anything at all. Alright. Obviously doesn't like coffee. I can drink it anyway. Oh no, he's drinking the juice. Alright. What's this? Oh, the bill. What's that? Steak. Soda. 220 for soda. Alright. 65. What the hell? Tax. You gotta be kidding, I ain't paying tax. Latest mate. Drop a couple of dollar. Let's go. I need to get out of this neighborhood before the police get here.
I didn't hear. Invisible wall. I live too far away to walk. I have to find another way to get back home. Ah, this cab conveniently placed in this game. Lucas Arts getting stressed. Oh, no, it's tense. Uh, Brooklyn, please. Ah, Brooklyn, nice. Nice. So we pick up some special ingredients. See that guy there, yeah. How blatantly is. Nobody he goes anywhere! A crime has just been committed. I'm going to have to ask you to stay calm and wait here for the police to arrive and check your IDs. Okay. Idiot. Gun made him catch me. Doc's diner. That's it. Why do they always wait for me to go on duty before they start killing each other in the middle of the night? You get me. Uh oh, slow down. Tyler, somebody gets murdered every day in New York. Yeah. We love slow down. But especially when I'm on night duty. It's as if every psycho in the city has it in for me. That's right. Come on, man. What's the slow down? Speed up. Down if you want a bitch, do it inside. That way I don't have to freeze to death listening to it. You get Well. Okay. Some more slow down here. Nice bit. Slow down. We like this. We like it. <laughs> You're the boss, Carla. Seems like she's the boss. He's doing well though. I don't like his jumper. It's quite... Yeah, this is this is fun now. This is very fun. Here we go. Slow motion. Let's check our frames. One frame a second. Beat that one frame a second. Two for three frames? Two. Okay. Aha. The frames have increased. Okay. Chat to him. In five years on the force, I've seen some murders. But you never really get used to death. You just learn to live with it, that's all. Nice. I still don't know if it was fatigue, cold, or something else. But I clearly remember the bad feeling I got when I walked into that restaurant. As if some part of me already knew that this time, something was different. Well, we ain't walked into the restaurant yet. What the hell? Can she see the future? Yes. What's his name? Leroy. I don't know, but let's go Leroy. How's it going, McCarthy? Evening, Inspector. I've been waiting for you. Hey, Tyler. Hey, Martin. So, what happened? Homicide. I found the body in the toilets. I had to go before I went home. Do we have a suspect? A client left just before I found the body. Ah, he left, eh? How? Which table was the suspect sitting at? Oh, he was sitting at that table over there. Is that the waitress over there? Yeah, Kate Morrison. I think that you should interrogate her. If you don't mind me saying, go easy on her, Inspector. She's still in a state of shock. Really? Were there other customers in the restaurant at the time? Yeah, two other guys. I let them go home. I wrote down their names and numbers in case you wanted to question them. Thanks for your help, Martin. It's late. I think you can go home and get some sleep. Yeah, I'm gonna wait until you're there. finished with Kate, if you don't mind. I want to make sure she gets home okay. Fool. When the symbol appears at the top right of the screen, you can switch characters. Bang. Press the caps lock button any time to switch characters. Okay. Hmm. You fool. You let a murder happen right under your nose. Yeah, won't be giving a good report about you, that's for sure. Hello, hello, hello. Aha, this woman. Shalom. Kate? Yeah, I'm Inspector Carla Valenti. 
I'm in charge of the investigation here. Would you mind answering a few questions? No. I don't like no. it. No. Go ahead. Uh, you Have you been working here long, Kate? Uh, it'll be 11 years next month. I've seen all sorts in this place. Down and outers, junkies, you yeah. name it. The till's been robbed a few times, but murder? That's a new one. Never seen murder. Oh, poor Johnny was such a nice guy. Oh, Johnny. Johnny's such a nice guy. He's dead now. Did you know the victim well? John was a regular. He came every Monday. He always ordered the same thing and, and left a nice tip. Ah, tip. No wonder she remembers him. Dush. Description. What was he like, Kate? Do you think you could describe him for me? I only saw him for a few seconds. I guess he was about average height, fairly young. That's all I can remember. Damn, they're onto us. Average height, fairly young. Was there something? Could anyone else? else have come in? No, I don't think so. You can only get in the front door. Oh. If somebody else had come in, I would have seen them. But that crow. There was a crow. John, was he alone? Slow down. Was John here alone? Did he speak with anyone? John always came alone. We chatted a bit, in the weather, his job, the usual stuff. Yeah, John's... He never talked to anybody else. Yeah, he was trying to help you, love, but you might pass him back next time. I'm sure a little bit of... Okay. John, the suspect. Did you get the impression that John and the suspect knew each other? The suspect and John were best friends. No, I don't think they did know each other. The man had already been here a while when John came in. Ah, they didn't so talk to each other. No, I'm, I'm almost certain that John didn't know him. I think that... You think what? Okay, spill the beans. Yeah. How can I fix this? I need to get my page. Oh, okay. Tell me about the facts. Can you tell me what you saw? There weren't that many people tonight. It's usually pretty calm during the week. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. Chatting. I didn't even see John get up. I didn't see you chatting. Oh my Telepathic. God. Okay, so that's what they mean about paranormal. Yeah. I insist. Kate, try to pull yourself together. You are our main witness, so I'm really going to need your help. My shift was almost over. I was just chatting with Martin at the bar. John got up and went to the restroom. The man must have followed him. And then he must have snuck out afterwards because I didn't even see him leave. Ah. What happened next? Martin went to the restroom, and that's when he found John. But then what happened before that? What happened before the murder? Did you notice anything unusual? No. No. It was just a night like any other. I was gonna go home. But then murder happened, you know, regular things, suspect. Did you happen to notice anything strange about the suspect's behavior before he went into the restroom? Yeah, he was a great no. guy. No. Yeah, wait. Yes. What? I remember something. What? I came back at one point Lies. just to check whether he needed anything. He didn't answer me. Lies. He just stared straight ahead. It was weird. I didn't push it. I thought maybe this guy is a little crazy. Lies. God. If I had only known. Do you think that you would recognize the suspect? I'll never forget that face. What? Perfect. Do you think that you could come down to the station tomorrow and help us construct a likeness of the killer? Don't believe her, Julie. Yeah. I'll do whatever you think I can to help catch him. Thank you very much for your help, Kate. Psh, okay. I hope you find the bastard who did it. Bastard. People like that just don't deserve to live. I promise you, we'll do everything in our power to find him. Yeah, yeah. Go home now and try to get some nothing. sleep. Yeah, Martin will make sure you get home okay. Martin. Yeah. I 
excuse me. Oh, Martin's getting in there. Okay, Martin, suits you, mate. Suits you nice. Good night. See you later. Martin's having a good time, seems. All right. Let's get out. Okay, chat to these guys. Nah. Let's investigate the crime scene. What are you doing in here, Leroy? Get out. Who told you you could bring yourself home? Cha. Aha. Eyes. Oh, looking, looking nice. Don't worry, love. Don't worry. You'll be all right. Windows open. Examine. Aha. A toilet. Let's take a quick dump. No, not today. No trace of a struggle. Looks like the guy was taken totally by surprise. You think? Several wounds on the left side of the chest, in the area of the heart. They appear to be knife wounds. Okay, knife wounds. Nice one. How you can tell? Who knows? Okay. Investigate. Aha! Dirty floor. I saw that. A pool of blood. This is where I killed him. Is she wearing gloves? Man, stab some what? dude in the toilet? You gotta be crazy. This guy took a big risk. Anybody could have walked in here and surprised him. What are you talking about? There's no risk involved, mate. Telepathic. <laughs> you idiot. I'm leaving, man. Aha, did he buy condoms? He tried to buy condoms. He was looking to get laid, but then he came to the condom machine, he saw that it was empty, he killed the nearest person with the glasses. Then he took his leave, paid his bill and left. All is well in the city of New York. Ah, magically following me around, okay. Alright, let's chat to them now, oh, maybe, no, 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 oh. Hey Garrett. Hey Frank. How's it going? Hey Carla. Hey Carla. So, you guys find anything? We yeah. took some samples here and there. We're almost finished. We were just waiting for you before we took the body away. Yeah, nice one. Good bit of waiting there. Okay, is that it? Nice, lads. Keep up the good work. Doing well. I can see. All right. I'll probably have to become this idiot. Isn't it? All right. Tab. Um, oh, caps lock. Okay. Yeah, cha. Let's see what I go on in. Yo. Yeah. Yo. This man be dead, you know. Bizarre. What? Well, he still has his credit card and a hundred bucks in cash on him. I guess the killer wasn't after his money. Hmm. The killer wasn't after his money. Let me quickly take it. No. Shall leave it for later. When, when this girl, what's her name? Lisa is not looking. Yes, Lisa. That's right. Okay, let me put my hand in the top fucking trash for no reason. Just oh, what idiot. exactly are you doing, Tyler? I'm checking for clues. What do you think? Nice, Tyler. Well done. Very smart. Stick your hand blindly into the fucking. Do you know if anyone has contacted the family? Not as far as I know. How did you get my phone? Oh. Right, I get it. Touch it with Are your you thinking hands. what I'm thinking? He wasn't killed in the stall. The killer dragged the body in to hide it. Clean it, mate. Okay, yes, yes, Tyler. Looking cool as well, don't worry. Yeah. Dry my hands. Okay, this is what the killer must have done. I must have come over here. Let's open this door. Oh, surprisingly clean compared to this one, which seems to have a dead body in it. Don't you just hate that? I'm going to take a lay some eggs and then there's a dead body. Oh well. Alright, mate. That's enough. 
See you later. Okay. Did you find anything, Tyler? <laughs> For that, I'd have to be able to keep my eyes open. Keep up the good work, Tyler. You're already tired, you know, Tyler. What is wrong with you, man? See you later, guys. Carla, she's really something else. She's not always easy to get along with, but she's the best damn cop I know. Just like last night, she was the best damn cop I knew. Come on, let's go, Carla. I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. I got a warm bed. I want to take another look around. We haven't found the murder weapon. It might still be around here somewhere. Cha. Sure. All right then. Yeah, Carla looks like she's the one's gonna do everything. Did he dash the murder weapon? Cook some food up. No. Probably didn't. What did I do with the murder weapon? I pressed murder weapon and it just disappeared. Okay, let's get out. Tyler, I'm gonna take a look outside. Yes. The crow. Where is the crow? Aha, this guy. Yes, the crow secretly protected. Good evening, sir. Whoa! <laughs> hey, uh, babe. <laughs> what can I do for you? Anything you want, baby. Someone was killed in that restaurant tonight. Did you happen to see anything or anyone unusual? Did I see something? Huh. I don't see nothing. I saw everything. I mind my own business. You. My name is Carla Valenti. And you? What's your name? John. My name? <laughs> Michael. <coughs> Mickey. What the hell is my name? <laughs> Nobody uses it anymore. Is Guess I name? just forgot it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Bogart. Yes. Uh, my friends call me Bogart. <laughs> Must be because I look so much like that act. Dear fella. <laughs> Seems like okay, Carly I'm gonna go. Try to get someplace warm. Yeah. Take care of yourself. Uh, Carla lost some. She got a bit more stressed. It seems. What, what's wrong with you? Getting more stressed. I saw someone. Uh -huh. Spill the beans. Yeah. Uh, or rather, something. <laughs> Nobody remembers it, but I saw him. I saw him come out the yeah. back door. Oh, it was evil. The devil himself. What did he look like? Can you describe him? Huh? Who? Uh, who? You drink too much, baby. You, you, you're talking nonsense. <laughs> nonsense. <gasps> This guy it seems okay. The knife? Did he throw it out the window? In the trash? In the fire? In the whatever? Okay, in the bin? No, 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 no. Change character. Aha. Uh -huh. Doc Steiner. Okay. See you later. Let's talk. Let's Come talk. on, let's go, Carla. I can't even keep my eyes open anymore. I want to take another look around. We haven't found the murder weapon. It might still be around here somewhere. You ain't gonna find it, love. I got rid of it a time ago. Okay. Seems like we got up. Aha, the fire. Get warm there, trampy boy. Claim that free fire there, okay. Seems like there's nothing out here. Let's get back inside. <sighs> the door only opens from the inside. Okay, why is getting more stressed now? Just because of that, eh? Ambulance. Nice parking there, mate. Right on the curb. Forcing me to walk on the bloody pavement. I mean, the road. What is this? Ah. Blood. The killer is wounded. Nah, he's not wounded, mate. This is a stupid camera angle. Okay. Alright. This way. 
way, that way, which way? Okay, this way. One last look in the book. Is there something in there? Probably not. Well, let's try again. Why is there blood here? Did you find anything? Possibly. He was I don't understand blood. why there would be blood here. Maybe it belongs to the victim. Not likely. Get Garrett to analyze it. Then we'll know for sure. Maybe it was a revenge thing. Or a psycho. This town is full of psychos. They're everywhere. When I was in the Bronx, I saw guys who'd rip your guts out and hand them to you. A table knife covered in blood. Obviously the murder weapon. Killer ah, used his silverware to stab his victim? That would seem to indicate that the murder wasn't premeditated. Mm, premeditated but... Tyler, there's a knife hidden here. It might be the murder weapon. Get Garrett. It Make might. sure he checks for prints and identifies the blood on the blade. The blade okay. Is. You fool. Let's get out of here. Bye. Got seen. No. Tyler's been my partner for almost a year. He grew up with the gangs in the Bronx before he decided to join the force. Yeah, I knew it. Sometimes he's unpredictable, but he's a good guy. Shakespeare. The Tempest. If this is his, it's a pretty weird book for a killer to be reading. Uh, who would read Shakespeare? Garrett, there's a book under this table. Why don't you check it out for prints? You got it, Carla. If he reads Shakespeare, he must be a weird psycho serial killer. Well, well, the coffee's not on the bill. The coffee's not on the bill. What does that mean? What a cup of coffee and a soft drink? That's weird. He's a caffeine addict, or else he wasn't alone. Hmm, nice bit of deducing that Mary, or whatever your name is. Easy Traces of blood. The killer was at this table. He came back and sat down after the murder. Hmm. Yes. Garrett, there are traces of blood in this booth. Okay, I'll go take a look. Garrett, go and take a look then. He's still standing there, mate. Well, let's go. You ready to go, Tyler? I think I've seen everything I need to see. Okay. Are you sure? We can take another look around if you want. What? You wanted to leave a minute? No. No, we're good. Let's head home. Okay, let's bust. It's time to get back to the car. I'm dead tired. Nice little pun there, dead tired. <laughs> Did you get it? No? Alright, let's go. Leave? No. Alright, see you later.